can see Prince Philip in her. Queen moved to tears, by Lady Louise's tribute staging, how touching. There were emotional scenes on Sunday evening as the Royal Windsor Horse Show's Jubilee Gala paid tribute to the late Duke of Edinburgh. As the event was coming to a conclusion, the arena applauded in memory of Prince Philip who died last year at the age of 99. The Queen looks emotional during Platinum Jubilee celebration as her granddaughter Lady Louise pays tribute to Prince Philip, driving the late Duke's carriage during moving display. The Queen was seen looking emotional at the Platinum Jubilee celebration near Windsor Castle this evening, as a moving tribute was paid to Prince Philip who died last year. Her Majesty's granddaughter Lady Louise, daughter of Prince Edward and his wife Sophie, led the tribute, driving Philip's carriage around the arena during the emotional procession at the finale of the Gallop Through History Platinum Jubilee event, which was staged by the Royal Windsor Horse Show. She donned a pretty makeup look with light pink glossy lips which matched her pink earrings. The late Duke was an active carriage rider well into his mid 90s, and Lady Louise has inherited his passion. The equestrian also made a heartfelt tribute to her late grandfather Prince Philip at the event, and sported her equestrian brooch, a nod to her and Philip's shared passion for carriage riding. Back in 2019, Philip was pictured proudly watching his granddaughter compete in the private driving singles carriage drive during the Royal Windsor Horse Show, where she achieved third place. On Friday, Lady Louise showed off her exquisite carriage driving skills again but this time it was her grandmother the Queen who had a front row seat. Her Majesty was all smiles as she and her daughter-in-law Sophie watched Louise, and the Countess couldn't help but proudly snap photos of her firstborn as she rode past. The show has been taking place over the past four nights, with the Queen attending on the final evening. The tribute was particularly poignant, as the Queen's 18-year-old granddaughter shares a passion for carriage driving with her beloved grandfather, who was instrumental in helping to establish it as a sport in Britain. Carriage driving was one of Prince Philip's favourite pastimes since the 1970s, and he raced carriages near Norfolk before going on to represent Britain at several world and European championships. Since inheriting her interest in the activity from the Duke of Edinburgh, Lady Louise is regularly seen carriage driving in Windsor, and at competitive events, including last month's British Indoor Carriage Driving Championships. The tribute came near the end of the night's entertainment, which saw ITV hosts Philip Schofield and Julie Etchingham deliver the event to the nation from an on-site studio hub from inside the grounds of Windsor Castle. Well-known faces including Andrew Lloyd Webber, Anton Deck, Dame Joan Collins, Sir Mo Farah, Dame Maureen Lipman, Sir David Jason, Dame Kelly Holmes, Moira Stewart and Sir Trevor MacDonald also paid tribute to the Queen's 70 years of service. The gala featured more than 1,300 performers, 500 horses, children's choirs, a 75-piece orchestra and stars from stage and screen. Meanwhile, some of the Queen's horses and ponies also took to the arena alongside carriages from the Royal Mews, led by Lady Louise driving Prince Philip's carriage. Prince Philip spoke about how he took up carriage driving when he stopped playing polo at the age of 50, during a May 2017 interview. He said, I was looking round to see what next, I didn't know what there was available. And I suddenly thought, well, we've got horses and carriages so why don't I have a go? So I borrowed four horses from the stables in London, took them to Norfolk and practiced and thought, why not? Opening up about how much Philip inspired her carriage driving hobby, 18-year-old Louise, who isn't a princess, got candid during an appearance on the Prince Philip BBC documentary last year. She explained, it's incredible to have learned first-hand from him. After a competition, he would always ask how it went. His eyes would light up because he just gets so excited when he talks about it. When we would go carriage driving, he would take me on a different route every day, I do not know how he managed to do that, and tell me all sorts of anecdotes about anything and everything, Louise added, about anything and everything.